Baruch Ata Adonai Eloheinu Melech HaOlam, who has made me to be free. Baruch Ata Adonai Eloheinu Melech HaOlam, who brings freedom to the captive. Baruch Ata Adonai Eloheinu Melech HaOlam, who has made me a Jew. Baruch Ata Adonai Eloheinu Melech HaOlam, who girds our people Israel with strength. Baruch Ata Adonai Eloheinu Melech HaOlam, who crowns Israel with glory. We now invite Risa Klein Herzog to lead the responsive reading on the bottom of page 87. The soul that you have given me, O God, is pure. You have created it, you have formed it, you have breathed it into me, and within me you sustain it. So long as I have breath, therefore I will give thanks to you, my God, and the God of all ages, source of all creation, loving guide of every human spirit. Blessed is the Eternal One, in whose hands are the souls of all the living and the spirits of all flesh. We continue responsively on page 90. These are the obligations without measure. Their fruit we eat now, their essence remains for us in the life to come. To honor father and mother, to perform acts of love and kindness, to attend the house of study daily, to welcome the stranger, to visit the sick, to rejoice with bride and groom, to console the bereaved, to pray with sincerity, to make peace where there is strife. But the study of Torah is equal to them all. Eternal our God, make the words of your Torah sweet to us and the house of Israel, your people, that we and our children may be lovers of your name and students of your Torah for its own sake. Blessed are you, Eternal One, teacher of Torah to Israel. We now invite Rena Lublin to lead the responsive reading, starting on the bottom of page 91. Praise be the one who spoke and the world came to be. Praise be the source of creation. Praise be the one whose word is deed, whose thought is fact. Praise be the one whose compassion covers the earth and all its creatures. Praise be the living and eternal God, ruler of the universe, source of our deliverance and help. With songs of praise, we extol you and proclaim your sovereignty, our God and ruler, for you are the author of life in the universe. We praise you, sovereign God, to whom our praise is due. We continue our service with the Baruch Hu on page 99. You can find the transliteration on page 536. Please rise. Baruch Hu et We continue responsively. Blessed is the grace that crowns the sky with stars and keeps the planets on their ways. The law that turns our night to day and fills the eye with light. The love that keeps us whole and day by day sustains us. Praise be the power that brings renewal to the soul, the vital song that makes creation dance. Blessed is the murmuring dark. Blessed is light to the eyes the fall of dusk, the flow of dawn, the turn of noon. O oh, give thanks for life's renewal, the radiant return of the sun. Blessed is the power of creation, praised be the light. We continue with the Shema on page 101. The transliteration is on page 536. Shema Yisrael, Adonai Eloheinu, Adonai Echad, Baruch Shem, Kivod Malchuto, Le'olam Vaed. Please be seated. Ve'ahavta, Et Adonai Elohecha, Bechol Evavcha, Bechol Nashecha, Bechol Meodecha, Vehayu Advarim Aile, 
אשר אנוכי מצבך היום על לבביך ושיננת עם לבניך ודיברת בם ושבתך בביתך ובלכתך בדרך ושוך בך ובקומך וקשרתם לאות על ידך והיו לתותפות בין עיניך וכתבתם על מזוזות ביתך ובישריך למען תזכרו ועשיתם את כל מצוותי והייתם קדושים לאלוהיכם אני אדוני אלוהיכם אשר הוצאתי אתכם מארץ מצרים להיות לכם לאלוהים אני אדוני אלוהיכם אדוני אלוהיכם אמת We now invite Rihanna Wheel to read in the middle of page 102. We worship the power that unites the universe into one great harmony. That oneness, however, is not yet. We see imperfection, disorder, and evil all about us. But before our eyes, we see a vision of perfection, order, and goodness. These two we have known in some measure. There is enough evil to break the heart, enough good to exalt the soul. Our people has experienced untold suffering and wondrous redemptions. We await a redemption more lasting and more splendid than any of the past. We continue responsively on page 103. When will redemption come? When we master the violence that fills the world. When we look upon others as we would have them look upon us. When we grant to every person the rights we claim for ourselves. Please join me in singing Micha Mocha. Micha Mocha by Li Madonai, Micha Mocha net arba kodesh, Nora tehilot osefele. Malchu techa rau vanecha, Boke ayam lifnei Moshe. Zeli Hanu Veyamru Adonai Imloch Leolam Vaed In a moment we are going to pray the Amidah, sometimes known as Fathers and Mothers or Avot and Imahot. I'd just like to let you know in advance there are some insertions here for the High Holidays. Um, and a couple of places that uh, things might seem a little bit out of order or incomplete. Um, we do get to the whole thing by the end of it, but there are a couple of, uh, a couple of little insertions in there. So um, please rise for the Amidah. We are on page 104, and the transliteration can be found on page 538. Adonai sefatai tiftach ufi agita hilatecha Eternal God, open up my lips that my mouth may declare your glory Baruch atah Adonai Eloheinu velohe avoteinu vimoteinu Elohe Avraham, Elohe Yitzchak, Elohe Yaakov Elohe Sarah, Elohe Rivka, Elohe Rachel, Elohe Leia, Ha'el Hagadol Hagipor Vahanura, El Elyon, Komel Chasadim Tovim, Vekone Hakol, Vizocher Chaste Avot Vimahot, Ume Vigula Livne Venehem, Leman Shemo Vahava. Zohreinu lechaim, melech hafetz v'chaim, v'chot veinu v'sefer hachaim, l'mancha Elohim chaim. Melech ozer u'moshia u'magin, baruch ata Adonai, magin Avraham v'ezrat Sarah. We continue together. Great is your might, O Lord, in this world. 
Great is the power in the worlds beyond. Your love sustains the living. Your great compassion is the source of life. Your power is in the help that comes to the falling, in the healing that comes to the sick, in the freedom you bring to the captive, and the faith you keep with those who sleep in the dust. Who is like you, mighty one? Who is your equal, O author of life and death, source of salvation? Who is like you, source of mercy? In compassion, you sustain the life of your children. We trust in you to restore our life. Blessed is the eternal one, source of all life. Please be seated. So the next part of the service is unique to the high holidays. It is called Unatana Tokef. Um, it's a prayer that's often very challenging for people. Um, it's, it's meant to call us into account, but some people feel uncomfortable with it because it feels like maybe God is too controlling or it takes away agency. Um, some people are comforted by it because it gives uh, meaning and order and structure to an otherwise chaotic world. But whichever way you see it, uh, Unatana Tokef still has one thing that we should keep in mind, and that is that humans still have the power over themselves. If we acknowledge what we have done wrong with repentance, if we ask for forgiveness through prayer, and if we do good works and act justly, sadaka, we can improve the course of our lives. We are on the top of page 107. Unatane tokef kedushat hayom ki hunora va'ayon. Let us proclaim the sacred power of this day. It is awesome and full of dread. For on this day your dominion is exalted, your throne established in steadfast love. There in truth you reign. In truth you are the judge and arbiter, counsel and witness. You write and you seal, you record and recount. You remember deeds long forgotten. You open the book of our days and what is written there proclaims itself, for it bears the signature of every human being. The great shofar is sounded, the still small voice is heard. The angels, gripped by fear and trembling, declare in awe, this is the day of judgment, for even the hosts of heaven are judged, as all who dwell on earth stand arrayed before you. As the shepherd seeks out the flock and makes the sheep pass under the staff, so do you muster and number and consider every soul, setting the bounds of every creature's life and decreeing its destiny. Berosh Hashana Yikatevun Uveyon Sam Kippur Uveyon Sam Kippur Yechatemun. On Rosh Hashana it is written, on Yom Kippur it is sealed. How many shall pass on, how many come to be? Who shall live and who shall die? Who shall see ripe age and who shall not? Who shall perish by fire and who by water? Who by sword and who by beast? Who by hunger and who by thirst? Who by earthquake and who by plague? Who by strangling and who by stoning? Who shall be secure and who shall be driven? Who shall be tranquil, and who shall be troubled? Who shall be poor, and who shall be rich? Who shall be humbled, and who exalted? Uteshuva, utefila, utsedaka, maviron et rogzera. But repentance, prayer, and charity temper judgment's severe decree. This is your glory. You are slow to anger, ready to forgive. Lord, it is not the death of sinners you seek, but that they should turn from their ways and live. Until the last day you wait for them, welcoming them, 
as soon they turn to as soon as they turn to you you have created us and know what we are but we are but flesh and blood our origin is dust and dust is our end each of us is a shattered urn grass that must wither a flower that will fade a shadow moving on a cloud passing by a particle of dust floating in the wind a dream soon forgotten but you are the sovereign the everlasting god please rise for kedusha nikadesh shachim kabalam kashem shemaktishim oto bishme marom kakatu vayad nevecha vikarazel zeve amar kadosh 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 Adonai Tzivaot Melo Kol Haaretz Kivodo Adir Adirenu Adonai Adonenu Madir Shimcha Bechol Haaretz Baruch Kivod Adonai Mimkomo Echad Hu Eloheinu Hu avinu hu malkeinu, hu moshienu vu hu yashmienu, berachamon leme kochai. Ani Adonai Elohechem, im loch Adonai leolam, Elohai ich tzion, ledor vador, Alleluia. Le dor va dor nagid god lacha, ule netzach netzachim kedushat kanadish, v'shiv chacha lo heinu mi pinu lo yamush le olam vaed. Uvechein ten padecha Adonai lo heinu al komasecha veimat cha veimat cha al komasheberata. Together. Lord our God, cause all your works to stand in awe before you, and all that you have made to tremble at your presence. Let all that lives revere you, and all creation turn to you in worship. Let them all become a single family, doing your will with a perfect heart. For well we know, O Lord our God, that yours is the majesty, yours the might, and awesome is your name in all creation. Uvechein ten kavod Adonai leamecha Tehila lerecha Letikva vetikva ledorashecha Grant honor to your people, glory to those who revere you, hope to those who seek you, and courage to those who trust you. Bless your land with gladness and your city with joy and cause the light of redemption to dawn for all who dwell on earth. Uvechein sadikim yeru v'yismachu v'sharim yalozu v'chasidim v'chasidim b'rina yagilu Then shall the just see and exult, the upright be glad and the faithful sing for joy. Violence shall rage no more, and evil shall vanish like smoke. The rule of tyranny shall pass away from the earth, and you alone shall have dominion over all your works, as it is written. The Eternal One shall reign forever. Your God, O Zion, from generation to generation. Hallelujah. Kadosh atav enorah shemecha, ve'ein eloha mi beladecha. You are holy, awesome is your name. There is no God but you. The God of all being is exalted by justice. The holy God is sanctified by righteousness. Baruch Adonai HaMelech HaKadosh We praise you, O God. You reign in holiness. Please be seated. We now call upon Landon Crawford to read in the middle of page 113. In love and favor, O God, you have chosen us from all the peoples, hallowing us with your mitzvot. 
Our Sovereign, you have summoned us from your service, that through us your great and holy name may become known in all the earth. In your love, O God, you have given us this Shabbat and this day of remembrance to hear the sound of the shofar, to unite us in worship, and to recall the exodus from Egypt. We continue responsively in the middle of page 115. Look with favor, O God, upon us, and may our service be acceptable to you. Blessed is the eternal God, whom alone we serve in reverence. We turn to page 116. Eloheinu ve'elohe avotenu ve'imotenu, our God and God of all generations, bless us with a threefold benediction of Torah. Yivarechacha Adonai ve'yishmerecha. May God bless you and keep you. Be this God's will. Ya'er Adonai panav elecha vichunecha. May the light of God's presence shine upon you and be gracious to you. Be this God's will. Yisa Adonai panav elecha ve'asem lecha shalom. May God bestow favor upon you and give you peace. Be this God's will. Sim shalom, sim shalom, sim shalom, tova uvracha, chen vachesed verachamim, aleinu, v'alko Yisrael amecha, sim shalom, sim shalom, sim shalom, tova uvracha. We now take a moment for silent prayer and meditation. We will continue together on page 118. If you are following along in our book, The Gates of Repentance, you'll notice that the next thing that would normally occur here is the Torah service. Uh, this year we have elected to make the Torah service be a separate service, which will be at 11.15 this year. So we are going to continue with the shofar service. The shofar service is in three parts. Malchuyot, which talks about God's sovereignty, the fact that God created the world and um, you know, and manages it and us. Um, then there is zichronot, which is remembrance, like yizkir, the same word root. Um, and it's about, uh, about like reminding us to be present and repent, but it's also about reminding God to remember our longstanding relationship, to remember us and our ancestors. And the last one is called shofarot, which, as it might sound, is about the shofar, both in terms of um, the shofar blast that uh, the rabbis say went off when we accepted the law at Sinai, um, but also in terms of calling us to action, calling us to be alert and be present to our world today and to what we need to do in it. Um, so, Norm, so normally, actually, at the beginning of the shofar service in Malchuyot, in the first section, um, there'd be something called the Great Alenu, which is when the high priest, in the days when the temple stood, would go into the Holy of Holies and say God's name, um, which we now 
referred to with the yud hey vav hey, the Yawa kind of acronym, because we don't know how to pronounce it. Um, and in traditional synagogues, actually, while you're saying the great Elenu, um, you might recall sometimes in the Bible it talks about people falling on their face before God, or maybe sometimes in the liturgy. Uh, and, and this is actually literal. So during the Great Elenu, even today, very traditional um, uh, traditional rabbis and traditional Jews will literally go down either kneeling or on their face in front of the Ark. Uh, in the interest of time, we're not going to do that today. We're just going to have our normal Elenu at the end of the service. But I just wanted to let you know it's there. Um, so we're going to continue with our shofar service on page 138. Hear now the shofar, acclaim the world's creation, and now recall Isaac's awesome trial. Hear now the shofar, you who stand at Sinai, and now proclaim the rule of Israel's God. Hear now the call and turn in true repentance, and now affirm the triumph of good. We are made in the divine image. We are the house of Israel, a kingdom of priests, a holy people. Know then the sound, discover its meaning. We continue with Malchuyot, the call of sovereignty on page 141. The Torah proclaims, your eternal God is with you. Shout a claim to your sovereign. The psalmist affirms, lift up your heads, O gates. Lift yourselves up, O ancient doors. Let the one who reigns in glory enter. Who is it that reigns in glory? The God of all being is the one who reigns in glory. The prophet declares, I am the first, I am the last, I am the only one. As it is written in the Torah, Hear, O Israel, the eternal is our God, the eternal is one. We now turn to page 142 for the blowing of the shofar. We would like to thank Rabbi Matt Dreffen and Julian Cohen for being our shofar blowers today. Please rise. Baruch Ata Adonai Eloheinu Melech HaOlam Asher Kedshanu B'mitzvotav Etzivanu Limshoa Kol Shofar Blessed is the Eternal, our God, ruler of the universe, who hallows us with mitzvot and calls us to hear the sound of the shofar. Baruch Ata Adonai Eloheinu Melech HaOlam Shechianu V'kiyamanu V'higiyanu Lazman Hazeh Blessed is the Eternal, our God, ruler of the universe, for giving us life, for sustaining us, and for enabling us to reach this season. Tikiya, Shivarim Trua, Tikiya, Tikiya, Shivarim. Tikiya, Tikiya, Trua, Tikiya. Please be seated. A reshet shefatenu yerev lefanecha al ram venisa. Arashat Safatenu Yerev Hanecha El Ram Venisa. O God Supreme, accept the offering of our lips, the sound of the shofar. In love and favor, hear us as we acclaim your sovereignty. We continue with Zichronot, the call of remembrance on page 144. This is the day of the world's beginning. Now we recall creation's first day. On this day, the fate of nations is in the balance for war or peace, for famine or plenty. So too with every single creature, life and death are in the balance. Every mortal's record is set before you, our acts and our schemes, our thoughts and desires. Blessed is the one who does not forget you, who looks to you and finds courage. Those who seek you shall not stumble. Those who trust you shall not be ashamed. 
We now turn to page 147 for the blowing of the shofar. Please rise. tiki Shivarim Trua tiki tiki Shivarim tiki Tikiya Trua Tikiya Please be seated. Arashat Shafate Nu Yaradvanecha El Ram Vanisa Arashat Shafate Nu Yaradvanecha El Ram Vanisa O God Supreme, accept the offering of our lips, the sound of the shofar. In love and favor, hear us as we invoke your remembrance. We continue with Shofarot, the call to attention on page 150. Our God and God of all generations, sound the great shofar to proclaim our freedom. Raise the banner for redemption of the oppressed. Signal liberty for all who are in exile. Bring lasting joy to Zion and to Jerusalem, your holy city. We praise you, the merciful God, who hearkens to the sound of the shofar. Please rise. tiki Shivarim Trua. tiki tiki Shivarim tiki tiki Trua tiki Please be seated. Harashet Shefate Nu Yerevanecha El Ram Venisa. Harashet Shefate Nu Yerevanecha El Ram Venisa. O God Supreme, accept the offering of our lips, the sound of the shofar. In love and favor, hear us as we call to you with the sound of the shofar. We now turn to page 156 for the Elenu. The transliteration can be found on page 546. Please rise. Elenu l'shabeach l'adon hakol l'atet k'dula l'yatzer b'reshit sh'lo asanu k'goye haratzot v'lo samanu Kamishpachot Adama, Shelo Sam Helkenu Kahem, Vigora Lenu, Kehohamonam, Vaanachnu Korim, Umishtahavim Umodim, Lifne Melech, Malke Hanachim, Hakadosh Baruchu. Shehuna te shamayim ve yoser aretz, hu moshe yekaro ba shamayim imaho, hu shchina tuzo, hu shchina tuzo, ve gov hem eromim, hu eloheinu einod, hem et malkeinu efesulato, kakatu betorato, vedata hayom, Vedata hayom vahashevota eleva vecha ki Adonai hu Elohim bashamayim mimal v'yaharetz v'yaharetz mitachat enod. The Nehemar 
Please be seated. Our thoughts now turn to those who are with us in our hearts and minds, but who may not no longer be with us in body. Please feel free to say the names of those whose yard set you are observing or whom you are remembering at this time. We are on page 158. If it is your custom, please rise for the mourner's Kaddish. Yit gadal v'yit kadash shemei raba, be'alma divra chirute v'yomlich malchute, b'chaye chon u'v'yome chon u'v'chaye d'chol beit Yisrael, ba'agala u'v'izman kariv v'yimru. Amen. Yehe shme rabba mevarach le olam u alme almaya. Yit barach vish tabach vit paar vit romam vit nase. Vit hadar vit hale vit halal. Shme de kudasha brehu. La ela min kol birchata vashirata. Tush bechata venechemata. Ta amiran belma vimru. Amen. Yehe shlama rabba min shemaya. Vechayim aleinu ve'al kol Yisrael v'imru. Amen. Ose shalom b'romav, hu ya'ase shalom aleinu ve'al kol Yisrael v'imru. Amen. May the source of peace send peace to those who mourn and comfort to those who are bereaved. And let us say, Amen. Please be seated. We here at the ISJL would like to thank all of you for joining us this morning for our Rosh Hashanah services. Uh, we'd also like to invite you to join us again at 11.15 for our Torah service, which will also have a Mishaberach if you're interested in saying that prayer. Uh, if you've not yet done so, I'd also like to encourage you to register for Yom Kippur services, which are in about a week. And also, if you are interested, um, please check our website to find a PDF of a Tashlich service if you would like to do that with your family, as well as a, a graveside service. We now turn to page 162 for the closing benediction. And now at the beginning of a new year, we pray for a blessing, the spirit of wisdom and understanding, amen. The spirit of insight and courage, amen. The spirit of knowledge and reverence, amen. May we overcome trouble, pain, and sorrow, amen. May our, day, may our days and years increase. Amen. Yehi ratzon milfanecha, Adonai Eloheinu, ve'elohei avotenu ve'imotenu, shetechadesh aleinu shana tova umituka. Eternal our God and God of our people, renew us for a good year. Amen and amen. We now turn to page 255 for our closing song, Ein Kelohenu. We'll be doing the first verse and the last two verses. Ein Kelohenu, Ein Kadonenu, Ein Kemalkenu, Ein Kemoshienu, Baruch Elohenu, Baruch Adonenu, Baruch Malkeinu, Baruch Moshienu, Atahu Eloheinu, Atahu Adonenu, Atahu Malkeinu, Atahu Moshienu. Shana Tova Umituka, may you have a happy and sweet new year.